Hey YouTube fam, welcome back to the channel. How you guys doing? I hope everybody's blessed still here in the land of the living. This is going to be a haul. It's going to be a pretty kind of long haul. Y'all know I like to talk. So, um, I can just chill out, wait a minute, get this stuff ready while you go get something to drink or snack on because, uh, I done did this. <laughs> okay, guys. This haul is going to be my last haul of August. Okay. I will not be doing another haul because me and a few of my YouTube friends here decided to go on us a no makeup buy. Makeup and skincare items. None for the month of August. And we decided this on Friday. So what I did was I jumped up and ran the altar because I know they had that red tag sale on Friday night and it was some stuff I wanted to grab. And I was planning on sticking to that. But then on Saturday, Ulta had that new Too Faced um, foundation. Y'all know the the new Born This Way foundation. And I, the one, the shade that I got is a little too dark. And they had it on sale at Ulta for $25. So, I'm sorry, y'all. I messed up. I had to do it. And then I got to keep being honest. Being honest. Yesterday, on Sunday, on Sunday, I get an email from uh, Ulta. And it was, if you buy anything on the site, you get a free Smashbox foundation. I never had a Smashbox foundation. I didn't buy it, technically, now. Technically, I didn't buy it. What I did buy was a face mask for $3.49. I got the foundation free. Now, all that's off my chest. is out there. I done told y'all the truth. So, as of today, as of this day, I ain't got that stuff yet. That's the only, only thing I've purchased. That's it. And that Tutti Fruity. Uh, Too Faced collection coming out. Y'all yeah, be going through withdrawals. I guess I'm going to do a video on stuff I want. But I will not be buying it. Officially. Officially, y'all, I'm with you today. Okay? But y'all got to understand them other two issues. I mean, that was kind of like a free foundation. And that Too Faced was $25. And when I show you the one that I have compared to the new one, I think I ordered Chai. And the one I have, I think it's maple or something. It's, it's dark. I'll do a video with that too. But I will not be buying any more foundation. Anyway, y'all. Y'all ready? Let's jump into this haul. This is what I went in the store that night when I was initially supposed to be on my no-buy. To check the red tag stuff. Wasn't a lot of stuff there. The only thing I really saw in the red tag that I wanted was uh, these rosy all day. And cheers to the weekend. These cute little cups. And inside the little cups are little, uh, they were $5. You see that? And everything that's on the red tag table is half off of the red tag. So they were two fifty, dollars and I got both for $5. And what's in here is our little bath fizzies. That's all that's in there. So I'll open them up. If I don't open it, it'll just join my collection of stuff that I don't use. And I'm cleaning up now, trying to get rid of that stuff. This will be sitting up with dust piled on it, and I will not open it. So we don't open it. There they go. They're just little bath fizzies. You just put them in the tub, and they fizz. They smell really good, and it's a cute little cup. So, yeah. For five bucks for both, couldn't beat it. Couldn't beat it, and they were five each, but that's the only thing I saw on the red tag sale. And since I was already in there, guys, you know I had to look around, and I honestly love this. I got this free from Ulta in an order. It's their um, coconut oil juice infused. It's juice infused lip oil, and this has coconut oil. And I just put it in before I put on my makeup and before I put on any dry um, matte liquid lips. And this is this is awesome. This is awesome. And then I wanted to pick up one of the uh, CoverGirl Easy Breezy Brow Pencils. I think it was Andrea Renee's video I was watching, and she really likes these. So I wanted to dribble, give it a try because I do use the Kat Von D Brow Gel and the Ofra Brow Gel. I just kind of combine them, and I come up with these brows. But sometimes they turn darker than what they were when I'm using them. So I don't know. I'm just I want to try this. All right. Now. Keep this moving. I'm going to try not to make this video too long. And I'm going to try to clean up, you know, my mess at the same time, guys. So, 
I only got one box from Sephora. I did really, really good with Sephora because it's Ulta now. It used to be Sephora, but it's Ulta that has my weaknesses because of the rewards, guys. Um, what do I have in here? The samples first, of course. Um, I, I'm not even going to try to say that, but it's Hermes. Just a sample of that perfume. Yeah, I know I got a spray. Yeah, I know I got to. I just got to see what it smells like. Oh, that smells really good. Oh, that smells good. Le Jordan D. Monsignor. Something like that. But it smells good. Of course, Marc Jacobs Daisy. And I got this Aqua Allegra. It's by Guerlain. And um, when I opened it, I was like, whoa. It's got like um, three different fragrances in there. I'm not going to spray all those because y'all be something. I'm going to spray one. I got you. <laughs> I got to spray just one. For real. Just don't be loud. Oh, this smells good. It's a real nice sweet scent. That's lemon something. But yeah, it's going into my pile of samples. And then I got a, a port. Was it? I don't know how they do this. It's a little special. I don't know what it was, but it's the Matte Velvet Skin 24 Hour Foundation by Makeup Forever. I got a sample of this in Y14. I don't know if it'll be, uh, nah, I don't look like it'll be dark enough. I don't think it'll be dark enough, but I'll do a review on this foundation if it's, nope, nope, y'all, we can't do that. I'll be looking crazy, crazy. Yeah, that's really light. Y'all didn't see it. I rubbed it into where I had my foundation. See there? That foundation is way too light for me. So, hmm. Can't even try it. Too bad. I don't need another foundation. I just ordered two more foundations. So, yeah. Thanks for the offer, but no thanks. And then I got this Juliet Has a Gun sample. Now, how was it? Oh, yeah. I had to give this shot. This Drunk Elephant Bronzer Anti Pollution. Uh, Serum Soleil. It's the dark one. The one that's supposed to, I guess, make your face look tanned. I just wanted this when I first saw it come up in the Witcher Order thing. Just to see how it would look on my skin. And actually, it just gives a little gloss. So, I'm going to have to try that up under one of those foundations that I got coming. Okay, now. I did grab the Natasha Denona Mini Lila Palette. That's what it looks like. And I always wanted the Lila palette, but then I was, you know, in a cross match between the Lila palette or do I get the uh, Sunset palette? And I like neutrals, but I love some colors. So the Sunset palette won, then I refuse to go back and pay that much for another eyeshadow palette. So, yeah, this is what the Lila palette looks like. Real pretty. Real pretty colors. I will be using this. I like that. I like that purple. This really dark purple right here. With the shimmers. That's the one I'm going to swatch. Hmm. Oh, wow. It's not a lot of shimmers in it once you rub it in. Not as many. But that's pretty. Okay. I will be using this. And then I picked up a Glam Glow uh, what is it? Gravity Mud Firming Treatment. I just got a small one. I stopped buying the big ones because the big ones seem to dry out on me before I use them. But yeah, I will be using this one tonight. Tonight. I love my mask. Um, the uh, Too Faced Peaches and uh, Too Faced. What is the from the Peaches and Creams collection? This lipstick had went on. Sale at Sephora for uh, this says it's a moisture matte long wear lipstick, and it went on sale for $10.50. And I really wanted one because I have this one that I have on. Hmm, it's dark, so I think I took it back in my makeup room. And I love my orange lipsticks. And this one is Where's My Peaches At? <laughs> Where's My Peaches? Where's My Peaches At? Okay, too fast, we're doing the most. And this is what it looks like. Oh, that's a real pretty dark orange. Let me swatch that right here. Oh yeah, that's pretty. That's gonna be real pretty with a brown liner. Yes, I like that. I like that. 1050. It was better than the 22 the original price, you know. 
can't just something about a sale it's kind of hard to run off from and then i finally finally grabbed this anastasia uh beverly hills bronzer and mahogany i don't have any brushes around me y'all know i want to put something on i don't have any brushes But this is what it looks like. I know everybody and their mama has seen this. But I was on the fence about getting it, not getting it. Because I had the Pure Cosmetics bronzers. And then I just had to go ahead and get it. And I didn't think it would be dark enough. Y'all know I'm going to have to go get a brush. Because somebody want to know will it's work for them. So let me go run and get a brush. And I'll be right back so we can test this out. Haha, -ha, I'm back. I grabbed the brush that Desi sent me. Thank you, my girl. Thank you so much. Again, I'm, gonna keep, I'm not going to keep saying it, I promise. Okay, let's see how this bronzer looks. Again, this is in mahogany. I'm going to make this video too long. And that's why I didn't get it because I didn't think it was dark enough or it would show up on me. I like this brush. Oh, it's showing up. Oh, we works for you. It works. It works for me. I didn't think it would. And this is the darkest shade. So, yeah. And I just love the packaging on these. I got the uh, highlighter when it first came out. I just love the way the packaging looks. It's just real pretty. Minus the fingerprints, of course. Okay. And then I picked up the Huda Beauty Banana Bread Easy Bake. Easy Bake Loose Powder. Mine is in Banana Bread. I did have this in Conifer. Conifer? But it looked pretty much like my um, my regular all over face powders. And I really wanted a powder that would work for me for highlighting. Oh, I like the way this packaged. Hmm. Oh, wow. I thought that was powder spilling out. But it's the way the box made. <laughs> Wow, that's crazy. Freshly baked. <laughs> that's neat. Now, I don't know if this is going to be too light, but we'll see. And this is banana bread, if I didn't say it. Pick up camera. There we go. Oh, no, that's going to be just right. I was looking for the smell because... I don't smell it. Let me put some on my face. And I already, I need, I'm gonna have to go get a, we're gonna see. I'm gonna put this on my face. I had to. I had to. I only got one brush in here. Oh, yeah, that's gonna do it. That's gonna do just what I wanted it to do. To brighten up without looking ashy. Yes, I knew sugar cookie would be too light, but that banana bread is just right. And I don't smell, it's a subtle smell. It's, it smells like, it smells just like uh, Avon candy. You remember that perfume by Avon called candy? It smells like a light candy. That's okay. And it has a little, some kind of little net in there, if you guys can see that. A little messy, a little messy, but the smell's not bad. I don't know where they get that from. I like it. Thank you, Huda Beauty. And I think that's gonna work fine for me. Yeah, that's gonna work for me. Okay, now this video gonna be we already at three minutes with me sitting up here trying on stuff. I'm gonna have to stop that. Y'all yeah, know I love to try on everything, but this video will be an hour long. Let me get through this video, and then I picked up a. a a Buxton lip liner crayon. This is in Stakeout. That's the color. I mean, that's the shade on the top. I guess that's too small for the camera to pick it up, but it says Stakeout. And these liners were so huge. I just wanted to buy just one. Look how fat they are. And then you have one end that's a brush, and then one end is a pencil. That's the lip brush, and then there's the pencil. And I'll just swatch it right here. Let's go up here. 
Yeah. Okay. Dang it, this video is going to be long. I'm sorry, y'all. Okay. I like the smell of that. I still can smell a little bit. Not loud, but I smell it. And it smells like candy. Candy by Avon. That, that old perfume is really old. It's been a long time ago, but I remember candy. That's exactly what it smells like. Okay, guys, let's move on. Let's move on. Quit talking so much. And then we can get into this old box, okay? I ordered this. Bam. From the body shop. <laughs> this was a great, great price. And I thought this little bag was super cute. And I said I could use it for putting, like, toiletries and stuff in. Um, I think it was like $12 or $14. It wasn't very much. It, it wasn't much. And you know, up to don't put the price on there. Um, on their receipts. So you can't really see what it was. But inside of here, I mean, it's just full of stuff. And I had, I saw what made me get it was the bonnet from a bonnet talk, y'all. It's a shower cap, but I'm going to make this a bonnet from a bonnet talk video. Haven't did one of those in a while. But yeah, you get the body shop shower cap. You get the Body Shop Banana Shower Cream. You gotta smell it. Oh my God, it smells just like a banana. It smells just like a banana. And then you have the 24 Hour Moisturizing for Normal Dry Skin Body Butter. My hands are a little uh, dry, so I'm gonna just go, you know, I'm gonna dip into it real quick. <laughs> Oh, it smells just like a banana. Oh, my goodness. Oh, it smells like banana pudding. That's what this smells like, banana pudding. Wow. I like, I'm glad I got this little set. I really want to try something from the banana, from the banana, from the body shop. And, of course, it was the bonnet that made me really want it. So, I'm glad I got it. I'm super glad I got it. Okay, keep it moving, I can Stop talking and keep it moving. I don't need this first lipstick. Put it right there. Um, and then I got me a um, super loafer body scrub from Earth Tentacles. Yes, they were on sale, so I had to get one. I really like these little things for a uh, bath and shower. It's just a loafer or a scrub. I'll feel the tingle, feel the clean. Yes. Keep it moving, keep it moving. Um, I got a couple of, what is this, Ultra Mask. I got the Brightening Yuzu Fruit Illuminating Bamboo Charcoal. What? Smart Skin Care Solutions Illuminating Bamboo Charcoal Sheet Mask. It's brightening. And then I got the Age Defying Matcha Tea Anti-Oxidant uh, Rich Hydro, wait a minute, hydrating, hydrolyzing acid, thin, smoothing, and vitamin E. It's a mud mask. And then, this had to be a freebie from them, and I'm glad they put it in here. I think this was from Lipstick Day. I got a couple of lipsticks in here from Lipstick Day, but um, this is the Tarte. I don't know, it's one of Tarte uh, matte lipsticks. It was just sitting on top, guys. I picked up two of the uh, LA Girl black liners. These are really good liners. They last a really long time. They really do. And they stay. They stay not all day, but pretty much half the day. Um, I got the More Than a Woman. Uh, lipstick by Aaliyah and Mac. I mean by Mac. You know, it's Aaliyah and Mac. And this is what the bullet looks like. That's really pretty. These are on sale half price on Lipstick Day. This looks like I don't remember. Oh, that's pretty. That is a really pretty color. Uh -huh. That is pretty. I'm glad I got that. Because when I first saw that collection, y'all, I'm just going to be honest. There was nothing in that collection that I was wild and dowed by. Uh, okay, I got a Bare Minerals Matte Lip Liqueur. And I have been had this in my cart for a while. This is in the shade uh, Devious. 
Why do I have all of these same color lipsticks? What is up with that? Look at that. That's the shade. I mean, really, Raquel? Like, wow. Okay. And that's Bare Minerals. Intense. Uh, intense color. Compliments for days. Matte Liquid Lipstick by Bare Minerals. That's what it says. And did I tell you the shade it was in? Yeah, Devious. This was on sale. Um... Was it 21? It was on the um, Too Faced Natural Eyes. I yeah, I was chasing the sales. That's what got me kept shopping. This is a Natural Eyes palette. I wanted it when it first came out, but I had so many matte palettes, I just didn't get it. And then I didn't know if I wanted to get the matte one or if I wanted to get the one with the shadows. But when it went on sale, I didn't even take a look at which one I grabbed. I just grabbed one. And this just says Natural Eyes. I don't know if it's matte. Oh! Wow, this is pretty. This is, wow, this feels awesome. This is really well made. It has a nice mirror. Look at that. And then they have some shimmers. I think this is a shimmer, not this. This right here is a shimmer. It's shimmers and matte. It's the mixture, but it, it's perfect for an everyday look. If you just need to take just one shadow palette with you, this would be the perfect one. That's beautiful. Okay. I think I'm taking this with me to BoxyCharm. Mm -hmm. And as always, Too Faced never fails to put your little cards in here with little looks that you can, you know, try to achieve. But this palette is, it's really nice. Really nice. Okay, so I went palette crazy and I don't need it anymore. I have so many that I've never even used, which y'all gonna see in this video I got coming. I got the Bare Minerals Gin Nude Latte Palette. Wow, fresh faced. Okay, they attempted to put a few little looks in here. And I think this was on uh, Tara's. On Tara's video, I saw her use this and she really, really liked this palette. So I just wanted to get it. That's what it looks like. Of course, it is another neutral palette, which is why, again, I'm going on a no makeup buy. Oh, she got that one. But that's pretty. I know why. And I love the way the front of it looks. That's just so classy. It looks like marble. Of course, y'all know I had to grab this. I had to have it. I have every palette that Anastasia Beverly Hills has ever came out with. So, Norvina could not be an exception. I had to have it. Um, I tried to talk myself out of getting it by getting the small, tiny Nartasha. I mean, the Natasha Denona palette saying that's enough purple I'll ever need. But in the end, I couldn't help it. I had to get it. Oh, wow. And it's even, it's just beautiful. I love all of Natasha. I mean, all of Anastasia Beverly Hills palettes. All of them. Look at that. Look at that. I know everybody named Mama done seen this, but I'm glad I got it. I'm so glad. I cannot wait to play in this. This is so pretty. Um, it's going to go in my box. What I'm doing is I'm making a little basket. This going to have everything I've never used in it. And I'm going to put it in a... Uh, I'm going to stick it in a box that I'm going to use this month. That's the only stuff I'm using this month is everything that's in this little basket that I'm getting. Okay, guys. I picked up a fragrance. This is Clinique happy heart i was at work one day and the um the laboratory girl came by me and she smelled so, oh oh my gosh she smelled so good i was like girl what is that you have on and she was like it's uh happy i said happy about who girl i don't know what the makeup comes and i started naming them and i finally said for me she was like girl yeah it's for me and i girl i went looking for it but when i got there i had two i didn't know which one to get the happy heart of the original happy oh this is a sexy bottle y'all know i am a sucker for packaging this bottle is just so sexy that is pretty i hope this smell as good as it looks like i can tell with all the stuff i done sprayed on oh yes this is it this is it this got a hint of something kind of strong a little stronger than what she had on a little sweet real sweet but I don't know. The bottle alone is going to make me keep it. So, 
out with that. I'm keeping it. Okay, guys. And then I picked up this uh, super blender and travel case. And this is an ultra brand of uh, beauty blender. Not a regular blender. It's an ultra brand beauty blender. And what made me grab this, not only, I think it was like maybe $4. But this little egg. Yeah, I know I'm going to the box time event. So I'm getting all my stuff ready for that event. So I can put any beauty blenders, this beauty blender, whatever, for that event. I can wet it that morning, put it in here, egg it up, and put it right, oops, in my makeup bag for this event. Any beauty, probably couldn't put this huge real techniques on in there. Now it wouldn't fit. Either this one or my original beauty blender will fit in there just fine. And I don't know. That's pretty soft. They might be onto something. Okay. I'm talking again, y'all. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm trying to move, but I can't stop talking. Take out all this stuff. I got a MAC Extender Play Gigablight Lashes. I really like the uh, Big Girl Bang for my bottom lashes, but it really tends to transfer. And I've been seeing a lot of people really enjoying this mascara. I guess they bent it themselves, huh? Because it all had, they all have a little bend in it. Yep, you bent it yourself. And it really made the bottom lashes stand out like wow. Yeah, I can't really see my mirror too far away. And y'all know I'm blind, so. Oh yeah, that does work. Okay. Well, I really wanted it. And it's really tiny. It's really small. But yeah, I got it in black. I don't know. I went ham on that. I don't know. I know it was some kind of sale. And then I got this lipstick in Mixed Media. I think Mixed Media was the free lipstick for that day. If I'm not sure. The, the, uh, this one, I think, was half off and on sale. And then Mixed Media was your free lipstick when you buy one MAC lipstick. And this is... Yeah, because it said at the bottom, not for resale. So I know this is a free one. And again, we have another dark burgundy. But I like that color. I guess I'm getting ready for fall, y'all. That's what it is. I'm getting ready for fall. Mm. My teeth are the color. But that's pretty. That's pretty. I want to see how it looks next to that, I mean, that Aaliyah. Okay. It's a lot darker. That's more of a reddy and that's more of a burgundy. Okay. Alrighty, I like that. Let's keep it moving. We're almost done, y'all. Ultra Beauty Have Your Cake and Make Two. This was on sale for $12. The original price, I think, was $24. But it was on sale for $12. So I picked it up. And it has the Smells Like Mushrooms, Smells Like Chocolates. Well, it's a marshmallow highlighter, a chocolate eyeshadow palette, a vanilla berry lip gloss, a tinted juice. A dewy setting spray, uh, eye gel eyeliner, and a shaved ice lip. Oh, let's get it open. Oh, that's cute. Everything's kind of tiny. But yeah, your next Ultra Beauty Collection cosmetic or brush purchase of $15 or more. You get bonus $5 off of it for buying this. Wow. Refer to this coupon under the product details. Wow. Okay. These are all the free stuff. The free stuff I got. Oh, wait. Now, before we get to the free stuff, I didn't even see this stuff I said in front of me. I really went insane. I got a Clinique lipstick. If I'm not mistaken, this Clinique lipstick came with something that I purchased. Oh, the perfume. It was free with the uh, Clinique Happy Perfume. That's what it looks like. I'll swatch it right there. Yeah, that's going to definitely need that brown eyeliner that I have. Let me get to talking a little faster. I got a free Buxton uh, lip gloss. I had got the Buxton bronzer, but it was way, way too light. So when I went back Friday, I took the Buxton bronzer back and I purchased the, uh, um, what did I get? I don't know. Was it the Anastasia? I think it was the Anastasia bronzer I got. And uh, anyway, this is the, this came free though. 
the full on lip polish in Celeste. And this is a real shiny. It's just, I love these. I love both of them glosses. Y'all know that already. That's it right there. They just make your lips feel really, really hydrated. And I don't think I have Celeste. I got her in one of the sample size, but not the full size. And then I have a Retro Matte Liquid Lipstick in Espresso. I thought I got this when I ordered. This is still not the right one. When I ordered from MAC, it's a really dark one. But this one looks more like coffee. It's not as dark as I want it to be. But that's it right there. We'll see. I don't need any more lipsticks. That will be one thing that I don't buy for a while. And then I got a Bare Minerals. This was for purchasing Bare Minerals. I'm sure this was free as well. Uh, lip liner. For purchasing that palette, this lip liner was free. And this lip liner is in uh, 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 Wired. Oh, that's a pretty rust looking red right there. Yeah, that's pretty. Okay, now we can get into this free stuff. Uh, I got a, a beauty bag, a $41 value. It's an Ulta beauty bag. And I'm thinking it's, uh, no, it's Bare Minerals beauty bag for purchasing Bare Minerals. I just got all the free stuff that they had, y'all. If this makeup bag was a little bit bigger, it would be going with new generation beauty, but it's not big enough, so it won't be going. Oh, wow, y'all. What is this? Prime Time. A Bare Minerals. Looks like an eyeshadow. And then we have a, a Mineral Veil. And a Bare Minerals Lash Domination. And then a sample here of the 2016 hour full coverage foundation. I just throw these away because this is not enough to tell anything. And I don't know why they send these to people. Because you, you can't tell by that little bit of amount. You just can't. But yet, we have another makeup bag. This is the Ultra Beauty makeup bag. And as always, it's stuffed. It is stuffed with products. And it's a cute little bag, too. Look at that. And this roomy. Now, this one, I may just take them both and put them down inside of one bag. Much. I got another one. This is matte. <laughs> okay. So, I got the dewy and the matte face spray. This looks like uh, another one of the mascaras. A little two-piece brush set. I'm trying to go fast, y'all, so this video isn't so long. A little Ulta two-piece brush set. The mascara. Another lip gloss. Mm, a tinted eye primer. Uh, a brow gel, which I love Ulta brow gel. It's in medium. If you've never tried this, you need to try it. It's good. Um, stay French. I like Ulta lipsticks. They're really good. Let me see if I can get into this. Yeah, it's going to take me too long because of the plastic on here. I'm not trying to make... Oh, there we go. Oh, that's a pretty color. Look at that. That's going to be beautiful. That's going to be good for right now. I like Ulta lipsticks, too. I had This will be my third one. Although I've never purchased them, I always seem to get them free. Um, but I really want to look at some shades to see what other shades they got. I got an Ulta gel liner. It's just black. Some makeup wipes. And then we have, well, let me just go and get into these two palettes really quick. My camera's about to die too, guys. So I'm hoping we get through this before it dies. Okay. Oh, wow. That's a cute little eyeshadow palette. And then this is a, a bronzer and illuminator, but it won't be for me. These will probably be high shadows or, or um, highlighters, you know, for my eyes. That's pretty much all that'll do for me. 
Okay, we're almost done, y'all. We're almost done. What is this? I do. These are just samples. Just samples in there. And then I have a colleague, another moisture surge sample. Uh, matte lip cream from Ulta. I don't need any more lip products. I have so many. And this is a Bare Minerals um, lipstick collection. Statement makers. A, a couple of minis of those statement maker lipsticks. This is what Frenchie looks like. I like that. Oh, I like Frenchie. I like her. Look at that. Can y'all see that? And then... This is what Hustler looks like. Ooh, like a brown red. Yes, put that right there. I'm gonna have to check out Bare Minimal lipsticks. That's pretty. I just said I don't need any more lipsticks. These companies know what they be doing. We did it, y'all. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's all. And I'm done buying makeup for this entire month. I'll be using my climate control frizz, my L'Occitane samples. I'm going to be using up all this stuff all month long. And tomorrow I'll come back, guys, and do this video of this big box of stuff that I'm putting everything in here that I'm going to be using all month. Um, more than likely, I'm going to add some stuff from this video, but I just don't want to have anything sitting in my collection that I'm not using anymore. That's just a waste, and it's senseless, and I'm, I, I'm just stopping it for me today. I'm stopping it, you know. It, it just makes no sense. All right, guys. I hope you guys are having a blessed day. And um, stay blessed. And I'll see you in the next video. The Lord said the same. See you then. Bye, y'all.